In this video, you will learn lemma plus LCM using division ladder. Welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you want to master lemma plus exam techniques to land in your dream grammar school, start right now by subscribing and clicking on the bell so you don't miss anything. Let's look at this example. The example we have right here is what is the LCM for three and four? LCM stands for least common multiple and we're going to find the LCM using the manual method. First, let's start off by writing the multiples for three and four. The multiples of three are three, six, nine, 12, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, 30. So let's stop at 30. Now, let's start by writing the multiples of four. The multiples of four are four, eight, 12, 16, 20, 24, 28, 32, 36, 40. So we're going to finish at 40 since there's no more space. Our next step is to find the common multiples for both the lists, for three and for four. Now let's start by scanning through both the lists. If you scan through the both the lists, the first number you can see appearing on both the lists is obviously 12. 12 appears on three and on four. Now let's continue scanning through the lists. The next number that you can see appearing on both the list is 24. 24 appears on three and again on four. So this is our second step done. Our final step is to find the least one. So between 12 and 24, which is the smallest one. Between 12 and 24, as we all know, 12 is the smaller one. This means the lowest common multiple, our answer is 12. So the answer to this question is 12. So I hope you guys understood everything so far. Now let's go on to the next one. Let's look at this question. The question we have right here is, what is the LCM for 9 and 12? Let's do this question using the division ladder. So this means let's write the 9 and then the 12 and then let's write the division ladder. So let's find the common factors for both 9 and 12. The common factors for both 9 and 12 are 3. Because 9 goes into 3 3 times and 12 goes into 3 4 times. We won't carry on further because there isn't any common factors between 3 and 4. So this means we will just times the 3, the other 3 and the 4. So 3 times 3 times 4. Let's write this down. 3 times 3 times 4. 3 times 3 is going to be 9. 9 times 4 is going to give you an answer of 36. So the LCM for this question is 36. Now, a way of verifying this question is by multiplying bottom left hand number to the top right number. So 3 times 12, does it give you 36? Yes, it does give you 36. So we can say 36 is right. Another way is multiplying the bottom right hand number, which is 4, to the top left number, which is 9. 9 times 4, does it give you 36? Yes, it does give you 36. So we can safely say that LCM for 9 and 12 is 36. So I hope you guys understood everything so far. Let's go on to the next one. Now let's look at another example. This one we have right here is what is the LCM for 24 and 36? Let's once again use the division ladder. So let's start off by writing the 24 and the 36 in a division ladder. Now we have to find the common factors for both 24 and 36. We can say the common factor for 24 and 36 is 4 because 24 goes into 4 6 times and 36 goes into 4 9 times. We can still see a common factor between 6 and 9, so we will carry on. The common factor for 6 and 9 is 3. 6 goes into 3 2 times, and 9 goes into 3 3 times. Since we can't find a common factor between 2 and 3, we can stop right here. So let's circle the 4, the 3, the 2, and the other 3. We have to multiply these numbers, so 4 times 3 times 2 times 3. Let's write this out. 4 times 3 times 2, and then finally times the 3. 4 times 3 is going to give you an answer of 12, 12 times 2, and then times 3. 12 times 2 is going to give you 24, 24 times 3 is going to give you 72. So the LCM to 24 and 36 is 72. So let's check if this is right. So let's do 2 times 36 gives you 72. Yes, it does. And 3 times 24, does it also give you 72? Yes, it does. So we can safely say the LCM to this question is 72. So I hope you guys understood everything so far. Now let's look at this question. The question we have right here is what is the LCM for 28 and 24? 
and let's once again use the division ladder. So let's start off by writing 28, 24 in the division ladder. So the next thing we have to do is find the common factor between 28 and 24. The common factor is 4 because 28 goes into 4 7 times and 24 goes into 4 6 times. We won't go any further because 7 and 6, they don't share a common factor. So we can just stop right here and we will circle 4, 7 and 6. So we'll have to do 4 times 7 times 6. Let's write this out. 4 times 7 times 6. So 4 times 7 is 28 and then 28 times 6. To work this out, we can do 6 times 20, which is going to give you 120. And then we can add this to 6 times 8, which is going to give you 48. If you add those two, you're going to get 168. So the LCM for this question is 168. I hope you guys understood this video and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Now to learn more on 11 plus maps, click the video on the right. And to learn the previous topic, click the video on the left. So take your pick. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.